everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's Pixie again, and if you're new here, welcome. My name is Pixie. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever you have to be doing when you're watching this. Everybody, fabulously and safely, and taking care of yourself and your loved ones. And after last night's fiasco, we're gonna go into a little, little zen, happier, happier, awkward times because today is Wine Wednesday, and it'll be my last Wine Wednesday until we get back from our vacation. But every day is Wine Wednesday if you want it to be. I do not judge, you should not judge, but. We'll just get right into the wine, and then we're going to do a quick little haul, and then we're going to talk about a giveaway. But first, the wine. And silencing my phone, because I always forget, because I'm a professional YouTuber. And I'm prepared. So... I also finally got my new case for my phone, the Disney one, but it's kind of um, pixelated, but I don't care. It's the same case I had for my last phone, but it has all the Disney characters in like a stained glass style. So it's super cute, and I had to have it for my new phone. And I found this on some random website that just does phone cases. So I'll link it down below, because I'm prepared again. Tonight's wine is a very easy wine to drink, and you can find this anywhere. That's why I chose it, because it is one of my favorite go-tos. Um, super cheap. Tastes good, a little bit of bubbly, and it's peach. This is the Barefoot Fruscato Peach. And like I said, it's it's like a Moscato, but it's called Fruit Scotto. It's a little bit bubbly. It's a very light wine. It's very crisp and easy to drink. They have strawberry and apple as well, I believe. I'll leave all the flavors down below, but peach is my favorite because they have a peach Moscato in Epcot in Italy. And that is my favorite wine to drink when we are drinking around the world at Epcot at Walt Disney World. And this is the closest thing I've actually found to it, and it's about $5. So it is, um, this is a 2019, but it's considered a rosé, which is very close to Moscato. So I'm not sure why they call it Fruit Scotto. Maybe it's just because the name is clever. But this is the peach one, and it's twist off. It's good for traveling, like this would be good for a beach or like a pool day. And I'm using the Mandalorian glass to switch it up because Wine Wednesday is special and we're just talking. But you can see it's got the bubbles. It's so good. Um, my husband actually is not a big wine drinker, but when he tries this in Italy at Epcot, it's like the only thing like, he cares for when it comes to wine. He doesn't even like it when I cook with white wine, or red wine for that matter, but there's a cute little glass. It's just a light, crisp, summery wine. It is very, it goes down very well. Um, I would pair it with fish and chicken, maybe a nice Caesar salad with some grilled chicken on it, or some ahi tuna, but it's so good. And it smells like straight up peach, so you can't go wrong with it. You'll know exactly what it tastes like. So cheers. Even if you're not drinking wine, cheers. Um, I did reach out to the seller on Etsy about how disappointed I was and how I felt like it wasn't worth the $40 and all they responded with thus far was, you can leave a review. So I'm going to wait 24 hour, or 48 hours, which I just did that tonight around 10 p.m. I have to wait 48 hours if they do not respond with a satisfactory response. Respond with a fact freaking response. See, I have words already. I'm cut off. Um, then Etsy will open a case. So hopefully, fingers crossed, I get my money back. And thank you also for everybody who's commented thus far on my last video saying that I was in the right and I totally got ripped off for $40. So anyways, um, I got a Shein haul. I got some Lily collars. And then we're going to get into the giveaway. So I highly recommend these collars. It was a great deal. I do believe it was like $7. And I got six reflective kitty collars so Lily has a whole dang wardrobe now but these are very safe collars they are quick release so for my animal lovers I will link this down below and the fact that they are reflective so there's the black one it's super cute all the little paw prints and hearts are reflective and it comes with a bell and the other ones have these moons and stars and the stars are reflective, and they're just good colors. They last a long time. Col colors. C colors, not colors. Colors. They come in different colors. <laughs> so much to do. Um, 
There's another paw print one. It's pink. Yeah, the, one, two, three. It said six pieces, but this is ten. Um, and they last her a while until like she gets caught on something in the yard, and she's my only indoor outdoor cat because she was a feral slash stray. But yeah, all these for like seven dollars. So Lily sat for a while, and I like the fact that they are reflective and they jingle. So yay for that. If you have animals, I'll leave it linked down below. Like these would fit a smaller dog as well. And then we'll get into Shein. I ordered some tank tops for our trip, a new bikini. I hope it fits this time because my last one did not. And these cute little stickers for my car. I got two of these and I'm going to put them on like probably the side mirrors, I think. So these were like a dollar. <laughs> We got little kitty stickers or decals. I think they're super cute. Definitely going on Simon. And then all of these are the same with different colors. I just got these basic camisoles. It kind of looks like this one that I'm wearing a little bit, but the, this one's older. This one's from Delia's. Rest in peace, Delia's. But I just wanted some basic new tank tops because eventually tank tops just kind of like wear out over time. So they look like a lot. Just cute little basic camis that I can wear with anything with shorts, under a dress, pajamas, with a skirt. Um, they feel really soft and they didn't cost that much. I think these are like $4 each. So I got five total. Oh, I also have like a little bathing suit cover-up thing I'll show in a minute. So I got pink and bye-bye stuff. Black with white. Blue with blue lace. White with lace. And then, of course, my favorite, the purple with purple lace. But the review said, like, you can't see your bra through them. Most tank white tank tops I get or light color tank tops, you can see, like, everything. So hopefully they're as opaque as they claim to be. And this is the bathing suit cover-up I got. I did place another order to Shein, but it won't be here till I get back, which is fine, I guess. But this almost reminds me of, like, uh, like I just love the embroidery on this little cover-up thing. But the embroidery reminds me of Anna, Anna from Frozen. So it's just this black mesh shift dress considered a cover up, but you could easily wear like a cute little spaghetti strap black dress under it or over it for like date night. And the material doesn't feel too scratchy. So it's just like a t-shirt cap sleeve style, but I love this embroidery. It looks so good and so springy. So yeah, I'm thinking like put it under a spaghetti strap dress and then wear a cute little corset belt and some boots and we are good for date night. So I'm going to take this with me. I haven't decided if I do want to use it as a swimsuit cover up or as a cute little dress for maybe our anniversary dinner. But super cute and it feels so soft. And then the bikini I got, I ordered a medium this time because it did say like my bust size and my waist size and all that stuff. But it's this little pastel purple number. And even though we're going to the mountains, I know they have hot tubs, so don't try to tell me I didn't need to buy a bathing suit. So this is a cute little skirt cover up and it's just got like, where's the front and the back? Okay, there we go. <laughs> cute little flowers and a little side tie on it and little ruffles for the skirt. And then it's just a basic halter top. I'll try this on. Even though I hate my stomach, I'll do it for you guys. And the bottoms appear to be full coverage, but even if they don't cover enough, I have that little skirt that goes with it. And then, not from Shein, but I got this dress. I'm probably not going to take this on my trip. It's more like a Disney or beach thing, but this is by La Chen. I know, it sounds like Shein, and it looks like Shein, but it's not. And it's got this crisscross back and front in this cute little tie-dye print. So that would be good at Disney or wherever, also date night. And it's just like this pastel rainbow tie-dye. Yeah, see, not Shein. La Shen. La Shen. But I like the material. I thought it'd be more cottony, but I actually like this. It's like a rayon. 
so that is it for my little haul and sippy sippy let's get into the giveaway um i am as of now at 549 and i would love to be at 600 when i get back from vacation so once i'm at 600 here's what you can win um i'm gonna do a get ready with me when but tonight we're just watching oh my goodness i haven't even opened it yet so let me get this Okay, my hair was doing things also, so it's, yeah, it was humid today, but it didn't rain. We need rain. Come on, rain. Anyway, awkward. So I would love to be at 600 in the next week. And yeah, it's kind of like a participation thing, I guess. I don't even know what I'm doing, but like if I get to 600, this is what you will win. There's two of them. I'm gonna do get ready with me. Hopefully neither of them are broken, because then we'll have like a little setback, but this will go on for a week. Scissors. Scissors. I have tried this brand of makeup before, and I try rainbow palettes that are cheap, so you don't have to. It is by Beauty Glazed. So I have two of these. It's called Color Fusion. They are cruelty free. Um, let's just open the dang package and I'll show you the palette and then we're gonna make sure the other one isn't broken so know that I'm opening both if you want to do this giveaway but I have to get to 600 to do it fingers crossed because it was in a nice padded envelope I was going to say it has the cover on it, but there's no mirror. This one is intact. And you can see how beautiful these colors are. It is a mix of mattes and shimmers. And it got great reviews. So when I announce the giveaway, it'll be a get ready with me for this palette. <clears throat> and I'm not really sure if I should open it and show you that it's not busted. And like, just, you can take my word for it. <laughs> The other one is not broken, but it's right here. I'm giving away one of these. So this will be my swatchy swatch one tonight. And we're gonna see how pigmented it is. And then when I announce the winner, it'll be a get ready with me. And that's one of the things I do here. I try cheap rainbow eyeshadow palettes. So you can, or you don't have to. But what I'm gonna do for this giveaway is once I reach 600, you have to be publicly subscribed. You have to comment on this entry and then do the thing, like all the things. Um, if you recommend anybody to my channel and you help me get to 600, then you'll be entered, but you also have to comment a word that I have not decided on yet. Um, <laughs> and then we'll announce the winner. And I'm gonna wait a couple days after I reach 600 to make sure I stay at 600 because you know, sometimes you get some stragglers and then YouTube does its thing and then you have to start over, but we're gonna make sure, like we'll say I'm at least at 6.05. But if you wanna comment and then share this channel or this video to get me to 600, then you can be entered in the giveaway. It's just like, help me get to my goal and you get some eyeshadow. But I'm going to randomly pick some colors and we're just gonna do like five to see how the pigmentation is, but this got great reviews on Amazon. And if you end up not winning, I'll just link it down below because it's from Amazon. And let's see, I'll do like, we'll do Roy, Roy G. Bev. So I'm gonna try this pink one right here, which is more like a pink red. It looks like a shimmer. It's very, very buttery. I'm okay with that. That's very nice. Very pigmented. That is one swipe. So we'll do an orange. That's not too bad. I might need some build up, but we'll find out. Here's like a dandelion. 
there. That's a super awesome yellow. And if you're not new here, you know how I feel about yellow eyeshadows. And then we'll do a green. Well, this came out more like aqua, so close enough. It's a matte. There you go. That one needed some work, but I'm not trying to press too hard just to get the first impression. And then we'll just do like a purple. Um, I feel like the thumb is the hardest. There we go. And purple's not looking too bad, but you know, like you can work with these colors. But it would be great if you don't have like a basic primary color shadow palette. Or if you're just starting out on makeup, or if you just really like this palette, get me to 600 and we'll talk. <laughs> and then I'll just do like the random name picture. If you comment with the phrase or the word, we'll just do a word, but try to use it in a sentence. Like, I'll just ask if you still use a lot of hand sanitizer. <laughs> I don't know. Just say hand sanitizer. It's the first thing I saw on my desk. But this could be yours if I get to 600. So I will probably just keep this open as long as I have, like if I reach 600 and it stays there for a little bit, then I'll just say, okay, time to announce the winner. Thank you guys for getting me to my next goal. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited about this and I will try to answer comments like while I'm gone. I have like one more video left. It's going to be a pack with me and my hair will be rainbow tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I'll keep reminding everybody to come watch this video and do the giveaway. I need to stop doing this. But now that you've seen the palette and what I got from Shein, um, yeah, let me know what you thought about this down below. And if you are interested, be sure, like all the things I said, I'll leave it down in the description about joining this YouTube giveaway. I'm not affiliated with YouTube. I bought this palette with my own money. It must be 18 years or older. I cannot do any international right now because of the way of the world and shipping is super expensive so maybe once I get to a thousand I'll do international and local the way my friend Dilly Lafay does and I'm probably gonna throw other goodies in with the palette so of course there'll be other stuff yay stuff um, but yeah uh, all the all the fucking all the stuff <laughs> all the things will be down in the description below. I'm super stressed right now. Uh, we have so much to do before we leave and with this Etsy thing I've just been in a mood so I figured I'd do an uplifting Happy Wine Wednesday. I know I usually wait in between videos to post but I'm super excited about this giveaway. I'm super excited about 600. Um, I guess the last thing would be like if you share my channel or if you mention me on your channel just let me know and I'll watch the video or see the YouTube or Facebook post because I feel like we could do this as a team because I'm rooting for you and yeah I hope you're wearing whatever makes you happy cheers to wine Wednesday and if other people don't like what you're wearing screw it because if it keeps them up at night up at night it's not your problem as long as you're not hurting anybody and whatever you whenever you look in the mirror and it makes you smile keep doing it and i love you so much i'll talk to you in the next one love you bye i'll pixie out love you bye love you bye love you bye i'll provide you bye love you bye love you bye, love you, bye.